Welcome back to another episode of Paul Arm Only and get for, Seriously, service. woman? I'll, I'll just get out of your way, sorry. I shouldn't have uh, been too close to you. There we go. Uh, my bad. Uh, and guess who finally decided to show up? Toma, and normally I'd ignore him, but it's on Raiden Shogun's banner along with the Shivers, so Shivers constellations are a potential. Um, yeah, in terms of how to get Toma here, there's one option and one option only, and that is just absolutely trash the Kamisato estate. That's honestly, like, I have no idea what to do as a wishing ritual, so all I can think of is we just trash this place, and then Toma's like, oh my goodness, we're gonna have to clean, and the only way I can ever show up here again is hangout event or, um, if I, you know, become a playable character. Oh my goodness. So I guess what we'll do is we'll become a playable character so we can fix the Kamisato estate. Because look at it. It's in shambles. It's all burnt down. He needs to come and replant the grass and everything. And we're going to chop down the trees as well, even though you can't actually chop down the trees. My goodness, look at this. Look at that. It's it's all messed up. I'm also stepping in his sand, but it's not messing it up for some reason. I'm leaving mushrooms and eggs lying all over the place. I'm going to steal his radiant spin crystal right here. I'm gonna talk to his shrine maiden right here. Look at this. Oh my goodness, I'm talking to his dear beloved shrine maiden. Uh, didn't say anything to her, but whatever. Um, yeah, that, that, my friends, is how you get Toma to appear. Check this out. A wild Toma approaches, right? Right? I do not want to sit here and spend a wish. I have saved for so long now. And I mean, obviously, as you can see, I have like 18,000 Puma gems. Um, however, I do want Shiver's Constellations. I am willing to go to a full pity. But see, if this is going to happen, I'm not going to be very happy because I want Chevrus or Toma. But we we do have some currency. And besides, we want to get a bit more star glitter so that we can buy more stuff. But yes, we do want Toma and Chevrus mostly. I don't really want Raiden Shogun C1. So if we get like a C1 Chevrus and a Toma, I'm happy. Even not the C1 Chevrus. Like, I'll stop before I get to Pity. I'll go check my Pity now. I just did two temples and you don't remember that. But, uh, yeah. We're only stopping once we get a Toma. There's a Chevrus Constellation, which is a plus, I guess. Yeah, History says... <laughs> I don't want Raiden Shogun Constellations that bad. But, uh, History says 10... 13. 13. So, we're at 33 now. Uh, now 43. Do we get our Toma? Please. Please, I'm begging you. I just I just want one Toma. This is, he's literally the only four-star polearm I haven't gotten, and he's been on so many banners, it's just been not polearm banners, so I've been ignoring him. Mika, why? I think that is like my C4 or 5 Mika. I don't even use him anymore. It's C5 Mika. I'm I can nearly do a full-on physical DPS. He keeps appearing randomly as well, which is the funny part. 53 pity, please. Please just got Toma. I'm begging you. How did we get a Mika? We've gotten everyone else on the banner. And more. Now we just need a Toma. We just need a Toma. We just need a Toma. I don't care. I'll go all the way. This is 63. Next is 73, which is just, just touching soft pity. Again, Shepherd's Constellations aren't bad. But I don't really want Raiden Shogun Constellations. But if I get them, I'll take them. I just want a Toma. This is obviously not going to go well because we're wishing for a four star. This is 73 pity. This is officially just touching soft pity. That's a book. That's not a Toma. That's a book. That's a tome. <laughs> it's a tome, not a Toma. Okay, well, this is a five star, I think. Yep. Oh dear. Just give us Toma at least with it. Whatever it is, whether it's a loss or a win. It's a loss to Dia and we recently grabbed a Dia. So that's a little bit frustrating, but whatever. It's not a Toma. It's not a Toma. It's not a Toma. It's not a Toma. It's fine. It's fine. I didn't save so long. Just, I totally didn't. Just give me a Toma, please. Just, just one Toma. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I missed him so many times and you're telling me I'm still not going to be able to get him even on the banner. Why? Why another lion's roar? What are the chances? What are the chances? Oh my goodness. I'm going to be broke on Primo, but at least I have a guaranteed. As long as we don't, you know, two, three, I think it's at the fourth? No, the fifth. That's a Shivers. That's a Shivers. That's a Shivers. That's a Shivers. I don't mind Shivers constellations, but I want my Toma, please. Please, Toma. Two, three, four, four, no. Oh, gosh. Shivers, please. Shivers. I want a Toma. Stop. I don't really want to go all the way to Soft PD again because I do not want to get a Raiden Shogun Constellation. But I do want a Toma. That's Sara. How is this happening? Oh my goodness. No. Please. Just a Toma. Four. Yes. It's good to meet you there at last, go. traveler. 
I've yes. been hearing about At you what? for a long time now. I have too. <laughs> I'm your new buddy, Toma. As long as that's okay with you, of yes, course. Yes, it is very okay. It is very, very okay, Toma. You can stay. Oh my goodness, that took way too long. But we have our... Just hit me with a double now, of course. Whatever, I'll take a C1, Toma. Okay, so... Uh, a couple of um, wishes later, just a, just a few. Uh, we have a C1 Dia, which is very frustrating because I, if I had known that, I wouldn't have grabbed her. Um, but how could I have? Uh, we have probably a C6. Yep, a C6 Kujo Sara. That's our second C6 four star that isn't a pole arm. We have our C1 when character protected by his attack time is own blazing blessing cooldown is decreased by three seconds. Well, oh. That's pretty cool. So it just gives a three second cooldown decrease. That's pretty, that's actually nice. I like that. Um, level up. We, I can't say pre-farmed, but we grabbed a couple of things. We have all of his mushrooms. We have like two boss runs in the back pocket. Um, and we just completely ignored his ascension. But uh, yeah, I have some fragile resins. I have enough books to max level him. Uh, we will keep grabbing his stuff. Okay, um, Shivers, how many constellations do you have? C5. If we didn't get the second Toma there, I'd say let's just do the three wishes to the four star, but it's a whole another temple and that will probably net us a right in Shogun. Yeah, I'll take it. C5 Shivers and a C1 Toma. Uh, let us go do his boss again. I have a brilliant team crafted. Uh, I think I just accidentally changed it again. Was it this one? Oh yeah, it was this one. And then I changed you for you because yeah, this is a totally sensible team that will definitely be very good for fighting the Pyro Cube. Yep. Yep. Yeah, so we're, we're not going to level him much, unfortunately. Oh, why'd you go to start with Meatball? I hate you. Just whack him, whack him, whack him. No. Oh. No, it was me and so oh dear. Right. I don't know it's still gonna be immune, I wouldn't have freaking hit it like that. Oh, that's pretty nice. Um Toma, come here. Come here, buddy. Oh yeah, I don't know why you have that attack ascension. I will still never understand that, but whatever. Uh, okay, we got our second wish we can put on. I think his weapon we're going to do. We're going to steal Mika's for now. Our C5 Mika. We're going to steal this. Thank you. Bye. That's mine now. Artifacts. I think we can do two piece. Um, yeah, we're just going to. Oh, what am I doing? I'm totally not stealing Candace's half bolt stuff again. That I was barely even trying to properly boulder with, you know. We'll just do four piece emblem because like I can't think of anything else and it's not really that good but like I have nothing else farmed to give him like a two piece two piece hit. I could do two piece a four piece noblesse. Oh also uh Hutao got an upgrade a pretty substantial one. She got this flower which is pretty nice um along with this is her stats now 71 240 which is not bad. It's not horrible. Normally I would like more crit rate but it's a Hutao so that's not really a thing. Flee. I didn't hit it. Damn. Gather. Also, where's my audio? I'm just hearing nothing. This is awful. Nowhere to this run. This is a horrible experience. This is really yeah. horrendous. Please there give me no my audio escape. back. Thank you. Nope, it's still. Surrender. Oh, this is horrible. I hate this. Order guide you. Oh, 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 oh. Thank you. Finally, took you long enough. Okay, this time we do not go and use this too early. There, the moment has power applied, it'll hit. Sounds like animal. What? What did I do different this time? Oh, three. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Means two more runs, and we should. Oh, yeah. So, um, uh... And we need to change the name card to something else. Um, to uh, the Raiden, no, Chenny Vale. Yep, this 
doesn't look bad at all. That looks horrible. What is this? Defeat after being hit by its mimetic three hit combo. Okay, cool. I didn't even know I got hit. But if you say so, I guess I did. We'll get him to level 70 and then I will finish him off off screen because I can't finish him off right now. Two. Okay, doesn't matter. Also, I just realized I took off all her stuff, right? Wow, she has 20k HP without a single artifact equipped. That's impressive. That is, oh, three stone. Not bad. Um, That is our Toma. Uh, I think we need to, nope, we got enough from the boss itself. No, 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 that was for the previous one. But yeah, uh, we can't really take him any further. That being said, uh, this is your Toma. Oh my gosh, he's so good looking. Wow, oh my goodness. We got big Toma. We've got him on a decent bit of energy recharge. I think it might be a little much. Because of him being in a full power team. Let's see quickly. Let us... Let's go do Abyss. I mean, I guess he won't be receiving any healing. So we'll just do the one with more HP. Yeah. Yeah, 25k. He's not going to have much because, you know... um. <clears throat> level 70 but i mean this is mostly just to check out his energy recharge capabilities it's not like his ascension passives give him any more okay so a quick little segment do not take this as an actual test i changed way too much stuff in between um like i changed his weapon and then changed to hu tao team so essentially he would get more particles so he would obviously get his burst back more than before so yeah just don't actually <laughs> take this as a test i was just messing around in the end and not being very smart but uh it doesn't matter because because of something uh i am changing his whole build anyways to change a little bit so yeah uh partially because i realized that uh, shivers does give healing because i don't know what i was thinking there but uh yeah anyways that's it he just completely missed his e so that's a bad test Yeah, like he completely misses E and he didn't get Shervis's particles, so that's a really bad test. <laughs> but I mean, clearly he doesn't have his burst back. We will check now, though. If we do this. Okay, we don't have burst here. Okay, we actually hit his E that time. We are not taking damage with this garbage ass shield as is. And oh, I forgot how good Arlie Chino is in the Red Blood team, like her personal damage. She gets like an additional 10k. Which is still so good though. Like really, she is. <laughs> She's still really, really good. Like, I'm going to make an Abyss video again, but like, I already know the outcome. I, I already know the outcome. It's definitely, I mean. Let's see, I think for team comfortability, we're going to put that ER pull on. And we're also going to work on Shivers' stats, even though I do love her stats and I'll show why. <laughs> I'll show why. It, it, it's dumb. Okay, she crystallized. Oh, that is some good damage bonuses. That freaking... That's visible from Kachina. Um, yeah, let's just exit quickly. Uh, I want to put on the ER sands. And yeah, like I said, I want to get a bit more ER on Chevrus. <laughs> but like, to change her build is a bit sad because first of all... Right, and then you look at her base attack. Oh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I want to get her a bit more ER, and I want to try to maintain the 40,000 HP. So it's going to be a bit difficult, but I do think it's doable. And also, I want to get a two piece something else that maybe replace the flower and the feather or four star sets of exiles, maybe potentially, but we'll see. Toma, we're going to switch you to the back to this. 
which works so well so so well this team is so good and yes you can definitely attribute that to the three five stars and two of them having their signature weapons definitely should have dropped emily's stuff first but my brain is not working maybe not as fast as i want them to though good damage really damn katina is so good so so good i'm so sorry yunjin but yeah i don't know maybe yunjin normal attack bonuses plus lizard. never mind we're just gonna kill the dude behind the lizard um maybe yunjin normal attack bonus plus still the same set just with um uh only the 12 percent ailment damage bonus obviously maybe it'll work oh, damn that freaking little dude just whacked strongly i just completely forgot to do this yeah that's so good katina is so good well it's not really katina it's just the artifacts that she has See, a 1A deal is massive. It's really massive, especially considering Hu Tao's upgrade decreased her HP by a little bit. So I don't know if what I should do is, even though she's on a Shimanawa set, just press her E whenever I start, and then switch to the other characters, do their stuff, and then hopefully, I don't know why I did that. Oh my goodness, and freaking Emily just hitting so damn hard. Emily with her weapon is so unbelievably good. So I do this, then I do this, then I do this. And Toma has his back. Shivers does not. See, now she's kind of like the weak link. Not that she needs her burst. See, then I do that. Going to Raiden Shogun, use Raiden Shogun's burst, and then hopefully by the time I'm done using Raiden Shogun's burst, Hu Tao can still use the attack bonus that Shivers' E gives without getting healed. That's not a bad idea. I really should be theory crafting this a bit better. You know, well, not theory crafting, but just strategizing, I guess, this a bit better. Um, He has enough energy. I do think this is fine. I'm not going to go further because I want to leave that for Abyss video. Um, But yeah. Termo still does perfectly fine. Uh, well, no. Termo does perfectly fine in the Hu Tao team, I think. I just need to switch away the round the switch around the way I work a little bit. So start with Hu Tao E, which I should have been doing all along, to be honest. Switching to Ryan Shogun, getting Ryan Shogun's E down. Maybe, maybe Hu Tao E into a normal attack, or even a charged. Then Shogun E. Then Termo EQ. Hopefully by then I don't take a hit from anything because remember we don't... Well, no, we do have a healer. Shivers is a healer. I'm a dumbass. Um, but we do have a healer, but the point to keep Hu Tao low means that we'll go from Shivers to Shogun um, without, uh, you know... We'll, we'll try to use all of Shivers' healing on Shogun and then switch to Hu Tao. But that does mean that Toma's shield is probably going to be gone by that time because how long does his burst and shield lost his shield lasts eight seconds but it does get refreshed his burst lasts 15 seconds but it can summon a shield right at the end which would be an additional eight seconds right yeah c6 shivers doesn't really work well with hutao works brilliantly with um arlecchino because arlecchino can actually utilize the c6 without actually getting the healing i said actually so many times i'm so sorry and hutao does actually fit Jeez, Hu Tao does fit decently in the Dendro team. So, yeah, there's that. That? Yep. Only polearm character I don't have now is Shen Hung. So, yeah. that that's I'm, I'm a collector, okay? I've got to collect them all. Got to catch them all. Pokemon. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, that's... Um, it's just, I guess, a dumb video now. Um, I really just wanted to get a Toma. I wanted a Toma, man. It's been, it's been way too long. It's been over a year nearing a year and a half that we've had this account without a toma and there have been a lot of banners with toma on but because i already had the pyro element i was like uh is it really worth accidentally getting a five star also it is nice to see damn polarm account with bad luck 
like technically speaking in terms of five stars and four stars that is nuts that is not something we usually see here it is nice to see but uh yeah thanks for watching hope you do have an amazing rest of your day and uh bye bye toma plunge